Biden and Putin not currently expected to hold joint news conference following meeting next week. Next week, Biden and Putin will meet in Geneva, Switzerland, for a high-stakes summit. The final plans are still being worked out and may change, according to two U.S. officials familiar with the situation. This is in contrast to a meeting between then-President Donald Trump and Putin in Helsinki, Finland, three years ago. Following that, both leaders spoke to reporters, during which Trump sided with the Kremlin over U.S. intelligence agencies, drawing domestic criticism. Russia also does not anticipate a joint press conference at the summit's conclusion. Putin, according to Peskov, is not going to Geneva solely to appear on the same stage as Biden. He goes on to say that the deterioration of relations between the U.S. and Russia necessitates a meeting. After the talks, Biden says he'll talk to reporters. Officials familiar with previous U.S. meetings with Putin say the Russian side frequently requests a joint press conference. It's one of several difficult choices that must be made when preparing for meetings with Vladimir Putin. Biden says of his message to Putin, I'll tell you after I deliver it. When I was working for President Obama, I was in the room with Putin many times, Ben Rhodes says of a previous meeting with Putin. At these summit meetings, whataboutism is always a feature, Rhodes says. That nothing really matters, that it's not worth challenging this, that everyone is equally corrupt, he adds. If you haven't done yet please subscribe our channel.